What the heck is this? Uh, where's my stuff? The gauntlet! Uh, I guess it's Jack's now. Gotta get back, find the admin, find my friends! The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. So. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. So. Um, uh, hello? Uh, Echo? Echo? The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. zone. Yeah, I heard you. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone, or else they get the lava. The lava. She's got it. Point made. Oh, look, an orange line. Bedrock? The admin said a place where I'd never see the light of day again. What is this place? So, Jesse, how was your day? Oh, it was great. Met a red, glowy, all-powerful, crazy person who trapped me in a near-indestructible cage. <sighs> and lava. I'm sure this is leading me to a place full of sunshine and cheer. Just here to make sure all guests behave themselves. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, yes, Jesse. Welcome to the Sunshine Institute. It's a reformatory for people the admin has found difficult. I'll be your warden. So the admin created this nut hut too, huh? Of course. The admin is an endless source of building brilliance. Including this beautiful behavioral adjustment retreat center. So it's a prison. Hey, no, no, we don't use the P word here. But it is a prison. Let's not challenge authority. The admin doesn't let us use that word, so we don't use that word. Understand? You know he's not here right now, right? You never know. What about my friends? I need to get back. The admin put his gauntlet on one of them. Who knows what he's making them do? He gave them the gauntlet? Oh, man, lucky them. That means they're the admin's favorite. <laughs> How great would that be? I bet your friend is living it up. Enjoying the high life right by the admin's side. It really doesn't last long. The admin's a finicky little tyrant. That's exactly the kind of attitude that got you sent here. And if your friends are anything like you, they'll be making their journey to betterment right next to you, I'm sure. Now hang on a tick, I have a... another guest on my manifest. Female, hothead. Favorite weapon? Sword. Favorite tool? Sword. Favorite food? Sword? You gotta distract him! Petra, that's definitely Petra. Jesse! Oh, man, I am so happy I found you. 
this freaking place. I know. Let's get out of here. Wait, you can't. It's too dangerous. Stop them, associates! Feeling shouty? Shouty, punchy, butt kicky, freaking admin. He tricked us. He tricked me. Oh, it just makes me want to scream again. Ah! Yeah, I can't believe the admin tricked us into thinking he was really boss. Yeah, he's good at disguises, but I'm good at punching, and I look forward to showing him that personally. And the admin has Jack. Ugh, it never ends with that guy. <sighs> Looks like we're trapped. Not gonna lie to you, Jesse. Not sure how we're gonna get out of this one. Hey, sound the alarm! We'll never make it through like this. Then we run! Where? Wherever they aren't. Stop them! Don't let them reach the burrows! we are. What is that? about now. Yeah, maybe not this way. No! What are those things? A spider? A creeper? Must be the admin creating his version of what a monster should look like. Of course, why would there be only one? There's never just one. Oh no, oh no, oh no! <laughs> <laughs>
sense, and already apprehended in an escape attempt. <sighs> that is just... That is just rude. Take this one to the mushroom. And bring that one to my office. Now. Close the door, would you? Do as you're told. Uh, sure. Obedient. Good. You and your band of misfits may have hope yet. Band of misfits? Oh, let me show you. Radar! Nerm! You see, here at the Sunshine Institute, there are two types of guests. People who make the admin extra angry, such as yourself, and your punch-happy friend down there. And there are people who the admin sends to make sure the first group will be, uh, well-behaved. Your friend, with the glasses, is surprisingly feisty for such a skinny guy. You think you want to mess with me and my friends? You think wrong. You mess with me, and you mess with my friend. The admin. And that's something you definitely don't want. Bring up Jesse's leverage, would you? Skinny guy, glasses? Funny story. When I first got here, I was actually part of the second group. We were just a crazy couple of griefers. Simpler times. No, 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 this place is filthy! Ah, ah, so disorganized! Ah, making me crazy! Jesse! Oh, I'm so glad you're okay! I was so, look, I was so worried! Oh, this place is terrible! Radar, I am so, so sorry. This is all my fault. What are you talking about? Meet the Iron Breath Taker. Iron bars to hold the victim in place below. Sticky piston above to shove an iron block down over their head. <gasps> I said before that you could follow in my footsteps. That could start now. Ready to improve that pesky bad behavior of yours and join the good guys? Work for me as an associate and help bring order to these poor, chaotic individuals. Don't do it, Jesse! <laughs> What's it gonna be? Okay, I'll do it, just stop! Oh, that's so great to hear. Hi, <sighs> that was so dark. <sighs> easy, easy there. Radar, was it? You just had quite the harrowing experience. But don't worry, our newest guard, er, associate. We'll be walking you out. Jesse, no. I don't know how much more of this I can take. <laughs> We're still in this together. We are still a team, now and forever. I'm just hoping this now isn't forever. But thanks, Jesse. Well, well, well. Jesse, Jesse, Jesse. Stella, what are... 
How? Well, I appreciate you letting me out of that ice. I can't let that disrupt the new professional relationship we have now, okay? I'm sure you understand. I knew a day of reckoning would come for my rival. Oh, you two know each other? <laughs> I am just absolutely not surprised. Well, I absolutely am. Surprised you haven't already ruined this place, too. Keep an eye on this one, Warden. Where Jesse goes, trouble usually follows. Now come on, Jesse. No one wants a sour rival. Be like me. I'm a shining example of success. I barely arrived and I'm already bossing you around. <laughs> Isn't it grand? Let's go, Randall. It's Radar! Uh, that's what I said. <sighs> Stella's right. Commitment and loyalty to the admin's cause are cornerstones around here. The more friends stick together, the harder they make it for each other. So maybe readjust your concerns. There are bigger silver fish to fry than... than... friends. If anyone here needs a friend, it's you, Warden. Ever since the admin sent me here, I... What are you hiding, Warden? Not every prisoner here wears orange. Jesse. Let's go, rival! That's right! Go along, Jesse, to the mushroom! Exactly what I was going to suggest. I'll have your job before you know it, Warden. Be careful what you wish for, Stella. Show them around, would ya? Thanks. Excuse me? <laughs> Who are you supposed to be? We don't have a problem, do we? I need a moment to process. Maybe several moments. Don't listen to her. She's not as important as she thinks she is. Oh, you are certainly one to talk, Jesse. Ta-ta, Jesse! I'll be at my post supervising a more impressive cell block. Don't be too jealous. Or do. I wouldn't blame you. You okay, Radar? Wish I was. I need something to eat. Get my strength back. <laughs> You're in the right place. Guests make mushrooms too here. Guess I just need some mushrooms then. There's one! Mushroom! gonna starve waste away you don't have anything in your inventory you're usually so well prepared usually only I showed up here with no food no goods no nothing like everybody else I saw Petra earlier she might know what to do So fighting over a tiny handful of mushrooms is the only way they can eat? Mm, mm, yep. Mm, mm. That cookie looks good, dude. I know, right? Wait, did you eat all yours already? What? Uh, how do you get them? <sighs> okay, look. I thought you knew. The guards have a delicate supply of ingredients, none of which are approved by the warden. These cocoa beans. I don't have any wheat for you. But, I can tell you who does. That pile of gruesome can set you up with the wheat. Okay, that guy is one tough-looking customer. I do not want to deal with him. Look, Jesse, it's simple. You're an associate, he's a guest. You call the shots around here, not him. So, uh, I hear you might have some wheat? I need two of them. I don't know who you've been talking to, but it ain't true. Wheat is considered contraband in this facility, and I am nothing, if not a stickler for the rules. Cut the slime, guest. 
hand over the wheat before I make things difficult for you. Oh wow, here for all of five minutes. And now you're gonna push me around. <sighs> you better remember this. I want special treatment from now on. Yeah, yeah. Hey, come here. Wheat and cocoa beans. All yours, Jesse. No way! I've been down here for too long. I can't stand another second! Whoa! Nothing personal. I'm just mega, mega hungry. Ah, give me that. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm just so hungry. Uh, <clears throat> hello? What's going on in here? Jesse? I expect far better from my associates than this. One cookie's not that big of a deal. One cookie's not that big of a deal. And just who does this contraband belong to, hmm? Whew. <laughs> you all know that weapons are strictly forbidden at the Sunshine Institute. So who does this belong to? You might as well just come out and tell me. It'll be so much easier for everyone. Large Henry won't have to pummel anyone. No one will need to be pummeled. Okay, I, I, I confess, it's mine. I snuck it in. You liar! I crafted that with my own two hands! Stole all the wood, my dumb sugar. <laughs> I mean, oops! Real smart, dude. You know that misbehavior means getting sent down a level. And that means... No! Not the zombie mines! Not the zombie mines! Yes. Perhaps a little time harvesting rotten flesh will teach you something. Take him away. Well done, associate. You've successfully apprehended your first contraband. Keep up the good work. At least now I can make a cookie for radar. Definitely not getting back out that way. Hey, are you busting out of here? What? No, of course not. I never do that. Oh, hey there, guard friend. You just caught me putting the happy little finishing touches on my happy little painting here. What, uh, what you painting? I'd so love to paint a happy little mushroom, but none ever stick around long enough for me to paint. I know that you guards don't usually help little old me, but could you build me a happy little mushroom to paint? Here's some wonderful dirt for you to use. If it's not too much trouble after all. That is just, that is just lovely. Thank you ever, ever so much. Please, you must share your thoughts on my work so far. Don't you hold back now. Honesty's the best policy. Oh my gosh, it's great. It's, the uh, chiaroscuro is just impeccable, truly. So happy you like it, and now, I like you. You'll be spared when the bad thoughts come. Oh, it's my associate friend again. Hey, can I ask you some questions? Um, I'm really busy right now. Hey, 
Petra! Nerm! Hey! Ah, jeez. I am so glad to see you in one piece. It... that was... Um, so... Oh, boy. <laughs> I... it... that was... Petra, we're kinda tight for time here. What are you trying to say? That I was worried, okay? That I... that I was scared. <sighs> Watching Jack lose Voss all over again, just to get taken away... It was horrible. I... I'm gonna get us out of here, Petra. We will stop the admin. Yeah... Yeah, I know you will. You might want to get Radar some food. He doesn't look so good. Yeah, I'm working on it. Thanks for looking out. Hang tight for now. I'll be back. Hey. those cells belong to. Well, it's not much, but hopefully it'll help Radar get his strength back. I hope you're learning how to be a cooperative champion. Wait, what? Is that the admin? You are all here to be reminded of your potential. It's a recording? Come on. And I hope you'll see it in yourself, as I do. Because if you don't, well, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it, eh? In the meantime, demonstrate your cooperative potential, and you just may become the ultimate champion! As the associate walked up to Brick, he noticed that the lowly prisoner was narrating all his actions. Uh, yeah. Hi, I'm... The associate didn't have to introduce himself. Brick knew all about the associate named Jesse. The... Jesse was surprised to learn that the reputation of the Wither Slayer, the leader of the Order of the Storm, had spread so far. Brick was curious what Jesse thought of someone who narrated every action around himself. Brick waited for Jesse to say something. What would it be, he wondered. Jesse approved of Brick and his quirks. Jesse winked with approval, like this. Brick was happy for the approval, but didn't appreciate Jesse stealing his thing. I mean, come on, it was his thing first. Ever try to get out of here? Brick didn't want to tell the associate, but Brick remembered the punching that came from the others. Oh, the punching. So Brick decided to tell all. Brick knew that the only way out was through the burrows, a seemingly endless labyrinth filled with monsters and who the heck knows what else. Brick also knew that only one person has ever tried to escape. But Brick never speaks her name. But Brick will never speak of Prisoner X. So Jesse never asked again. I can't believe that Jesse That's it for now. Thanks, Brick. You're welcome. Uh, Brick told Jesse. You're welcome. I mean, seriously. Do you have any Brick wondered if Jesse had any other questions. Get it? I need to get some food. Any tips? Brick knows that the prisoners fight over the precious mushrooms. But Jesse is an associate. There must be other ways to get food when you work for the man. So, what are you in here for? Brick remembered the day the admin, annoyed with Brick's constant need to narrate, sent him to the Sunshine Institute to break Brick of the habit. Brick was promised release if he stopped, but nothing will ever break Brick's spirit. 
He will narrate forever. That's it for now. Thanks, Brick. You're welcome. And Brick told Jesse, you're welcome. Here, eat this. Get your strength back. Thanks, Jesse. I really appreciate... Uh, yeah, sure, thanks, whatever. Interesting attitude there, buddy. I'm gonna have to really step it up. I mean, this is prison. So from now on... I'm Prison Radar. I'm gonna get my own mushrooms. Make my own stew. Disregard my bedtime. Break whatever rules I feel like. Within reason! Um, uh, whatever, bro. Yeah. I mean, uh, whatever. Psh. Now, get out of here, guard. It's time for Prison Radar to show this world what he's made of. That's right! Come at me, dude! What's going Prisoner on? Prisoner X has escaped! I repeat, Prisoner X has escaped! All guests, please report to the nearest lounge. I think they mean cell? Yep, you should get in one too. You haven't had your Protocol X training yet. This place just keeps getting weirder and weirder. Prisoner X? Yeah, apparently she's this infamous prisoner who they have to keep locked up super tight. Always escaping. They say she even knows her way through that maze. Apparently she's locked up way deep in the prison. So deep that some people have never even seen the level they keep her on. That sounds like the sort of person we should get on our side. Yeah, no kidding. We might be able to get out of here yet with someone like that. But where is she exactly? According to NERM's sources, Prisoner X is locked up in the deepest, darkest level of the Sunshine Institute. Cell Block X. Uh, detecting a theme with the names. Yeah, they're big on that X thing. We need to get to Cell Block X. Way I heard it, you can't just get into Cell Block X. But it sounds like the zombie mines are right next door. If we can go down to the mines, maybe we can find this Zara person. Well, you're doing this whole associate thing, right? Maybe you can get the warden to, like, promote you. Might be worth a shot, even if the warden is kind of a dork. Hmm, the warden does seem to like me. Working the joint to our benefit. Prison radar approves. Okay, it's a plan. You stay here and rest up. I'm gonna find a way to get us to cell block X. Roger that, Jesse. But how to get promoted? That Oxblood guy sure looks suspicious. If I can catch him doing something against the rules, maybe I can get promoted. Buttons, nice! Now we're on to something. Okay, time to see what tall, red, and gruesome is hiding. Okay, looks like 
looks like the buttons move the blocks. I did it! Yes! Oops. Now if only someone had been around to see me being this impressive. Hmm. A mushroom? What the heck are you doing here? Sounded me like I could ask you the same question. Yeah. Mind explaining what you're doing in my most private of spaces? Visitors ain't welcome, and you are most definitely a visitor, hence not welcomed. Easy there, big guy. No need to get steamed. My room, my room, short stack. If you hadn't noticed, you left the hole open. Now get out of my cell before you regret getting in it. Did I hear mooing? Oh, come on! Excellent work, new associate. You see, this is how you get promoted. Work your way up. But first, to maintain order. This creature cannot be allowed to undo the balance of the mushroom. Shear it, uh, would you, Jesse? But then it'll be... An ordinary cow, yes. You know, bringing back the balance of the mushroom. Thought that was obvious. What? No! Don't do it, Jesse. Not liking your hesitation here, Jesse. You can't. You won't. You do want to be promoted, don't you? <laughs> I'm begging you. Fine, I'll do it. I can't watch. Jeff? You still recognize me right, buddy? Jeff? Jeff! <laughs> Jeff. Jeff? That wasn't so hard, now was it? As for you, Jesse, it's clear you are ready to advance to bigger and better things. You've been promoted to the lower levels. The zombie mines. I get to be your boss now, Jesse. Aren't you the luckiest associate of all? Now get a move on. We don't have all day. Welcome to the zombie mines, Jesse. Every few minutes, a million gross zombies spawn. The equally gross prisoners dispatch them and collect the zombie flesh, which is... It's gross. I, I get it, but why? It's all part of the admin's plan. I, um, you know, I think. To toughen people up. So if it makes the admin happy, then let's make him happy! Happy! I can't believe you're actually behind the admin in all this, that you actually believe in him. You're just jealous that I'm in good with him and you got tossed into prison. Who knows, maybe if you work hard enough, someday he'll give you a job, I don't know, cleaning up Luna's climate control llama house. <sighs> Though I suppose, now that we're colleagues at all, I shouldn't leave you completely in the dark. Our job is to supervise the guests as they deal with the endless zombie hordes. Even you couldn't mess this up. Eh, maybe I should knock on wood. Wow, I can't believe this is the Sunshine Institute's idea of a promotion. This is awful. Ta 
You! You are awful! You just can't... You... Okay, yes, it's absolutely atrocious. This may not be my dream destination, but at least I'm better off than her. Her who? Prisoner X? You must have heard that alarm before. She was recaptured, but not before taking out a lot of guards. Don't get any ideas, though. Only the Warden's allowed to see her. Now, if you'll excuse me, Luna and I are off to prove why we're the best associates. Are you being such a brat, Luna? Come on! Ow! Luna, stop that! I'm hitting my llama limit, Luna! Knock it off! She doesn't like it here, obviously. Well, yeah, but she will learn. Right, Luna, darling? Ugh. Don't you have some guests to punch or something? has sun and shine in it. And this place doesn't have either. Zombie and despair might be more accurate words. Hey, what is this? Oh, the big guy, Oxblood, was down for a while and headbutted the wall? Not sure why, but man, he has a hard head. We just haven't fixed it yet. There's redstone behind the wall. Hmm, I wonder what it connects to. Gotta be a way in, but this door won't budge. Hey, don't even bother trying to get in. See those item frames? Only the admin and the warden have the right items. They could be anything. Besides, why would you want into Prisoner X's cell? That's just bonkers. Stay away. You know how certain things are your business? Yeah, this ain't one of them. Well then, someone is salty. Hmm, so that redstone leads to this door. If I can bypass the redstone circuit, I can open the door. What happened? What are you guys doing down here? We couldn't leave you by your lonesome, so we cooked up some trouble and got ourselves sent down too. We're in this together, so we stick together. That's pretty dangerous. Maybe, but we're not leaving without you. What did you find? We need to find something to bypass a redstone circuit and get this door open. This will lead us to Prisoner X. She can help us get out of here for good. Jesse! No fraternizing with the guests. You know, we do know someone who came from the outside who might have all her inventory. Ugh, Stella. Really like that stuff, huh? Nah. Oh? I love it! High in protein, high in flavor, maybe just a little bit poisonous sometimes, but you only live once. You sure you don't want some? Plenty to go around it. Just say the word. Yeah, no, I'm good. Your loss. 
Jesse, you can't keep socializing with your guest friends over there. It's bad form. Gross. Yeah, uh, about that. I, uh, need your help. I need to make a lever. Pronto. Why, exactly? Not that I, you know, really care. It's probably stupid. You'd never know when you need a lever. That's what I always say. A lever? In a prison reformatory? Really, Jesse? Not helping you here. No, not risking angering the admin. I had to really prove myself to get this gig as it is. Not giving it up for you. He's just using you. How can you not see that? No, uh, it's uh, mutual. We're, you know, using each other. I think. Maybe you make some good points, but not enough of them. I have a place here. Respect. You know, a power, and the, yeah, the works. It's actually very prestigious. Many, many people would love to have this position. Many. But look at what it's doing to Luna. She hates it down here. What? No! She clearly loves... Okay, yeah, she really does hate it here. Okay, look. Maybe this isn't my dream destination. This place is horrible, and I am worried I will never get the smell out of my hair. Here's the cobblestone and stick. But you need to get me out of here. I know we've had our issues, but I also know that you're a hero or whatever. Uh, sure, Stella, we'd be happy to have you. If you're happy, I'm happy. No matter how many worlds I see, it always seems to come back to levers. Do this. Zombie wave incoming. Prepare yourself. Surprised. Admin? The warden told me you were zooming up the associate ladder. Now you're trying to disrupt the therapeutic benefits of my zombie mine? What gives? I don't know if you're dense or what, but working somewhere usually means you don't do things to actively destroy where you work. 
H hang on, Admin. I it's just a misunderstanding. L let's just talk this out. Misunderstandings? Oh, we are way past misunderstandings. Way past. Sir! I'm very disappointed in you, Warden. I, I'm just, I'm, uh, yeah, I'm just a nervous eater. I'm sorry. No, no, not that. Your star guard, Jesse, is nothing but a saboteur. You were my greatest hope. You were moving up the ranks, and now you've ruined me. I thought you were following in my footsteps. Yeah, I really pulled one over on you, huh? I... I... I really thought we were bonding there. Oh, for the love of... Enough! How truly you disappoint me! And that goes for you, and you, and you, and especially you. And as for you... I've been looking for an opportunity for you to prove your loyalty. To prove your worth as my champion. So, unless you want to be added to my naughty list, I suggest you pull out your sword and attack Jesse. And as for you, Jesse, well, don't think I don't believe in fair play. <laughs> now we'll have some real fun. No! I had such high hopes for you, Jesse. The highest of hopes. You could have been my champion. No, I can't. This isn't happening. Shut ears open. We only have one chance here. I'm gonna head over to the app and we'll both attack him. Trust me, friend. You're joking, right? That's your big idea. Swords can't hurt me. Uh-oh. Oh, all I asked you to do is fight your friend to the death, and you can't even do that. I don't even want you to be my friend anymore. And I don't want you to be my friend either. In fact, as far as I'm concerned, this whole place can burn to the ground. What about... Prisoner X, what about all of us? The Institute remains inescapable. So what do I care? I'm leaving. And I'm never thinking about any of you ever again. So I'll just be my own friend now. Can't dwell on the setbacks. Gotta keep looking forward. Do you even listen to yourself when you talk? That made zero sense. To you, maybe. But I don't care what you think. <sighs> I'm going to have loads of friends soon. After all. Everyone loves Jesse, right? No. Oh, no way. You coming? You're back, Jesse. Trust me. I take care of Luna for me. Coming, darling admin! Stella is just the beginning. Your other friends will fall in line, too. Lucas, Axel, Olivia, all of them. Don't worry. I'll take good care of Beacon Town. 
<laughs> He's gone. Jesse, we gotta stop him. Jack! Look, I am sorry, everyone. I, I can't... I just... I'm sorry. Uh, shut up with the sorries, you doof. Let's hope Prisoner X is really our ticket out of here. Man, am I glad you're okay, Jack. Hmm. Yeah, uh, it got a little dicey there for a while, didn't it? I mean, after what happened with you know, not Voss, then I was in the admin's freaky place and, and uh, not in control of what I was I was uh, doing. I was in pain. I I, I I was so scared that you'd all give up on me. Hmm. That's... that sounds horrible. Jack, we would never give up on you. Yeah, hey! I appreciate that, but if you'd seen what I'd seen... Beacon Town was already worried about you, Jesse. Wondering where you were, wondering if you were okay. I'm sure the Admin is heading there right now. Wearing Jesse's mug to boot. It's freaking messed up, yo! It's true. Identity theft is no joke. I don't care about who's wearing my face, I just want to make sure Beacon Town is safe. We made it! Wow. some intense security. Just stick close to Jesse, all right? Mm. We'll be fine. Don't worry. Yeah, you guys go on. Get Prisoner X. Mm. If I wanted to imprison the dreaded Prisoner X, that's where I'd do it. I think that's where we need to go. All we have to do is cross this conduit, reach the platform, jump down, and not die. Mm. Come on, I think we can make that jump. Oh. You're up next, Nurm. Oh. Okay, now you, Loon. <laughs> Seriously, how do you do that? Last jump! Jesse, you must be Prisoner X. <sighs> Bold of you to come here, not knowing who you're dealing with. I could shove you right into that lava, and you deserve it for being so trusting, so gullible. Just one little push. <laughs> and sizzle, sizzle, sizzle! I'm not your enemy. You don't need to threaten me. Yes. But it's so much fun to threaten you. I don't get much fun these days. Look, Prisoner X... Zara! You're supposed to know how to get out of here, right? What? Where did you get that idea? 
No one's ever escaped the Sunshine Institute. And no one ever will. I don't have time for lies, Zara. I need to get out of here. Oh, are we supposed to be friends now? <laughs> I don't owe you the truth. Or anything for that matter. The admin stole my identity and he's running around with my face doing horrible things in my name. I gotta get out of here now. Romeo was here? Just now? Well, um, the admin was, but who's... Romeo. That's his real name. You didn't think Admin was his given name, did you? He would want you to think that. Of course he would. That's funny. I call him Slimeball, because that's what he is. And a jerk. He has that effect on people. It's true. You must really be something if you made him so mad. He almost never comes down here in person. Except to put the Warden's feet to the fire from time to time. Well, there is no more Warden. The Admin fired him. That's fantastic. We won't have any trouble escaping with that little creep out of the picture. So now you want to help me? Any enemy of Romeo is a friend of mine, I always say. Well, I've never technically said that. But I think it sounds pretty good. Oh, so glad you changed your mind. Oh, you changed my mind, Jesse. You're obviously a formidable ally. But don't forget, you do need me. I'm the only one who knows the way out. You know the way, then show me. Let's get out of here. Just one problem. This whole room is rigged to explode if I step one foot out of it. Explode? Take a look around. If someone doesn't stand on at least one of these pressure plates on the floor, these sticky pistons will retract. Lava meets TNT. And then the whole place blows up before you can say kaboom. <laughs> That's a stone pressure plate. That means I can't just use a block. Oh, it's fine. One of your silly companions can stay behind. The rest of us can go. That's the situation. That's the only way out. Get back here! This is your cell! Oh, no, no, no. I'm not going back in there. I'm free, Jesse. And I intend to stay that way. I hate to be a wet slime about all of this, but we have to get moving. I can't just leave them here. Then just leave one of them here. As long as one pressure plate is stood upon, the trap won't spring. So either the villager or the llama must remain behind. Hey. 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 Nurm, no, you can't do that. Um. Oh, come on! We seriously don't have time for this! I'm leaving. If you're interested in escaping the Sunshine Institute alive, I suggest you do the same. My straitjacket? Oh, that was the easy part. If you're done with your tearful goodbyes, we have a prison to escape from. Prisoner X, I presume? Yeah, guys, this is Zara. Zara, the guys. Hello. Where, uh, where's Nerm? Oh, your villager friend offered to take my place so my cell's booby traps wouldn't go off. <gasps> what? No. 
He... he did that? And you let him? Stella asked me to keep Luna safe. Well, at least we have a llama then. <sighs> well, no matter what it takes, no matter how many heads I have to clobber, I will get him back. She better be worth it. Trust me, I'm worth it. Ugh, can we get going, or is the reunion still underway? Yeah, we're going, we're going. Come on. Run for your lives! The guests have escaped their lounges! The warden's been fired! <laughs> Zombie meat is back on the menu! When I find that warden, I'm gonna make him pay for what he put me through! Yipes. Wouldn't want to be the warden right now. Every prisoner in this place wants to tear him to pieces. He better watch his back. And his front, and his side. Yeah, lots of watching in his future. It's what he deserves. I won't be losing any sleep over it. <sighs> I wonder what the warden will lose when the prisoners find him. Let's see if they left us any weapons. Weapons! Sweet, sweet weapons! I could take the enchanted iron sword or the diamond sword with no enchantment. The diamond sword will last longer, but the iron sword is enchanted with sharpness. Not bad, hmm. Okay, definitely feeling better with a sword in my hand again. Agreed. What? It's versatile. <sighs> I don't know much about llama fashion, but that's a good look, Luna. Looking good, gang. Now let's... You jerks better not have taken all the cool weapons before I got to dig through them. Friends reunited. It's a prison miracle! Even if Jeff is a little... Uh, completely different. I ought to pound you to pulp for what you've done to Jeffy Boo! Incoming face punch! Look, big, red, and ugly. Maybe you should reconsider your emotions right now. <laughs> Prisoner X, oh jeez, I don't want no trouble. I'm out of here! Come along, Jeffy! That was... Frighteningly effective. Well, now that that's over with, can we get moving now, please? The opening should be just around this corner. We have a situation here. Back! Back! All of you! One more step and it's Kaboomsville! Jesse! Hey! You're wearing a guard's outfit! Well, guards ain't in charge no more. And furthermore, I'm not a fan of guards. So, thusly, you're getting beat up. A bunch. Oh, boy. Well, dip my bristles. Look who it is. It's my happy little friend who took a look at my happy little painting. Jesse, you freed Prisoner X? Just when I thought you couldn't ruin my life anymore! What in the world were you thinking? Holy crud! It's Prisoner X! I think you've clearly lost your mind. She is bad news. Actually, no, she is way worse than bad news. She doesn't deserve to be locked up. None of us do. Did you know she was once an admin too? The admin had to take her powers away. She tried to destroy him. I promised the admin I'd never let her free, no matter what. And I'll keep that promise. Even if I need to blow us all up to do it! Later, Tate. Hmm. <laughs>
<laughs> Why are you all staring at me? It's making me uncomfortable. So is it true what he said about you? You were an admin? Well, ugh, it's complicated. We want answers, Zara. Ugh, fine. Yes, I was an admin. Ages ago, Romeo took my admin powers away from me just before he banished me to this pitiful prison. But I'm not the villain here. Romeo and his little warden were the ones who put you down here, not me! So glare in another direction! I'm innocent! I'm sick of secrets. You should have said something. I assumed you wouldn't take the news well, and how right I was. No more secrets. Fine. No more secrets. We can't trust her now. Wait, so an admin can be stripped of their powers? Ugh, it's not simple, but yes. So what do we... We don't have time for this. It won't be long before Romeo finds out what's happened down here. Yeah, I guess we should keep moving. Follow me. I don't know if I can go with her, Jesse. I don't trust her. Petra, you haven't seen what the admin is capable of. We need any help we can find. But really? Her? I don't exactly have another ex-admin in my inventory, Petra. Uh, but we have to be able to... There must be a... Uh... Yeah, I don't trust her either. I want you keeping an eye on her at all times. Vigilantly. Romeo did always love creating new nightmares at every opportunity. Ah, run! Yep. Hey, Seriously, what's with these monsters? They're all glowing! They're pretty scary looking, Jesse. Must be scarier. <laughs> Let me think! 
Ugh, I knew we shouldn't have trusted her. Now we're lost. I said just let me think. Sure it's just thinking? Ugh! Oh, come on, she didn't get lost on purpose. No, I didn't. Thanks, Jesse. Wait, we can just build to the top of the wall and get to the other side that way. Yeah! Sounds good to me. Wait, where are you going? She ditched us! Guys! Don't come up here! What? Why? was unbelievable and you stuck the landing nice oh that it's just my perfect reflexes and photographic muscle memory well there it is guys our ticket out of here that is sparkly the sparkliest is that diamond <laughs> where is everyone that maniac is gonna get herself killed would that be such a bad thing we should lend her a hand shouldn't we maybe we should just go but she sounds like she's in serious trouble. Jack, we need to think about ourselves too. 
and the tower is right there. I don't want the admin to get anyone else I care about. We're not abandoning her. I told her I'd help her escape. It's time to prove it. We can't just leave her, come on. Ugh, I can't believe we're risking our lives for another admin. Come on! You came back. I said I'd get you out, didn't I? Now show us the way. I know you didn't have to do that. I appreciate it. Let's go. I'm not a very trusting person. Romeo betrayed me. I have trouble getting along with others. I'm not much of a people person anymore. If I ever really was, it's gone now. You're welcome, Zara. I would do it again. It was the right thing to do. There's something else you should know. There was a third admin named Fred. Where is he? Dead. He and I fought Romeo for control of the world. We lost. the rest of it? Yeah, how are we supposed to escape? This doesn't even go up that far. That's because we're not going up. We're going down. Down? There is no down. We're standing on bedrock. You can't go any lower. You might think so, but that's where we need to go. Below the bedrock. Everybody knows there's nothing under the bedrock except nothing. And also certain death. <sighs> we're not at the bottom of the world. It only appears that way. I'd rather take my chances in the maze than listen to any more of her lies. Any of you are welcome to join me. That's crazy talk. All those monsters... I don't care! She's an admin. An admin killed Voss, then stole his identity, and then... Remember I told you he took my admin powers away? Well, down there lies the secret to taking Romeo's powers from him forever. Fred, the third admin, discovered it. Jesse, help me dig through this tower. See? I told you. These stairs lead to our salvation. Now there's a good reason to get a move on. Uh, 